Hi everyone, this is Kevin from Caribbean Crypto Tips. In this brief tutorial video, I'll be showing you how you can mint your own NFT on the Cardano blockchain. Now some of you may be wondering how is that possible since Cardano has not yet implemented a smart contract capabilities? Well the truth is, NFTs on Cardano are minted differently than they are on Ethereum. Earlier this year, Cardano underwent what was called the Mary Hard Fork. And with this particular upgrade, the Cardano blockchain now has the capability of creating its own native assets or tokens on the blockchain itself. And these assets can contain metadata. And it is with this embedded metadata that we can add information about our Cardano NFT tokens, such as the name or description of your picture, your song or your video, and the corresponding link to the file on the IPFS network. IPFS stands for Interplanetary File System. That is where you can store your data safely and securely forever. Now the website that I'm going to use to mint my Cardano NFT is called nft-maker.io. This particular platform is relatively new and is still in beta. However, as you can see here, many persons have created NFTs already on this platform. Now I would have reached out to one of the creators of this website. His name is Patrick Tobler and he was kind enough to help me through some of the issues that I was having. Now Patrick is a young developer and he is a stake pool operator of the Babel stake pool. If you would like to support him and his work, then you can feel free to stake with his pool. Also, Patrick has submitted a Project Catalyst proposal to help enhance his website. So of course he's going to get my vote when that time comes around. Let's go back to the website. Now just to reiterate, the website is pretty basic at the present moment. You can only mint your own NFTs and display them. There is no active marketplace. If you scroll down and you click on an NFT that you like, you can get more information about it. Here you can see the name, the offer and the token details about this NFT. And this will take you to a pretty standard Cardano block explorer where you can see the minting transaction as well as the transfer transaction. So let's go back and mint our NFT. On the main page of the website you go to the top right hand corner and click mint NFT. You'll be taken to a page where you can submit a JPEG, a GIF or a PNG file to be uploaded. So there's no support for video files as yet but luckily I have an image file so I'm going to click select a file and you should see a file explorer box pop up. Now I'm going to go and select my file and I'll wait for it to upload on the platform. Now here it is and I go and click next. This is where you add your metadata as I mentioned before. I'm going to fill this in fairly quickly and come back. All they're asking is for title, author, description and possibly a web link. Now I just want to point out the description it enters seems to be a bit too long so you have to bear that in mind when you are creating your NFT. I'm going to shorten it a bit and perfect it fits. Now we're going to click next. This is the payment screen where you go to pay to get your NFT minted to the blockchain. Now depending upon the size and type of file you're trying to upload, this page may take a little while to finish render. But as you can see here now the price for minting on this platform is generally around 9 to 10 ADA. And I'm going to pay this transaction using my Uroi mobile wallet. Once it is confirmed, I should receive my NFT to the same wallet that I would have paid from. And as you can see the payment has been completed and the transaction has been confirmed on the blockchain. So therefore my NFT has been minted. All that's left for me to do now is to go and click done and view my NFT on the platform. And look there it is. So I successfully minted my first NFT on the Cardano blockchain. Now I can always go and check the token details to see that it has been transferred to my wallet. But I'm going to show you all a different explorer that you can use that might be better off to display your NFTs. And this block explorer is a visual block explorer called pool.pm. You can go here and search and I'm going to type in the address that I would have just used to mint that NFT. 
and here you can see my NFT has been visually displayed on this block explorer so it has been transferred to me successfully so that brings me to the end of my tutorial video you can now go and mint your own NFTs on the Cardano blockchain but I have a special announcement for you my subscribers if you want a chance to win this particular NFT all you have to do is like this video subscribe and comment below and one lucky winner is going to get this NFT sent to their Cardano address in my next video now if you enjoyed this video and you learned something then you can feel free to offer a small donation of Ada to help support this channel or you can offer me a cup of coffee because making these videos does take time and I am doing them free of charge so if you're feeling generous I have some links in the description below this is Kevin and I thank you for watching please stay tuned for the next video